We just thought we'd do a bit of a day in the life. We need to sort out some bits and bobs. So, I think we need to get rid of one of Mila's beds. So, organized cows, I'm so impressed. I'm very excited about that little draw right there. Yep, I've been canvassing whilst watching Gossip Girl. James exposing me. Look at us, look at Look at us, it's our bright colors, I know, too. look at us, we're shining. Hello, Hello guys. guys, and welcome back to our channel. Today we have a cleaning But it's not vlog. really a cleaning no, it's not. vlog. We just thought we'd do a bit of a day in the life. We need to sort out some bits and bobs. Yeah. And yeah, it, it's a very sunny day and I think it's going to be the last sunny day for a while. So yeah. we want to also kind of try and make the most of that. Exactly. So we want to like do a couple of hours of productive cleaning. Couple of hours. Couple feel of hours. An hour, half, half an hour, hour ten, ten minutes. Batteries flashing already on this camera. <laughs> Pro vloggers as always. Yeah, we want to feel productive, so yeah. then we can chill and enjoy the sun. Yes, and we want to do like a garden workout and stuff and Ooh. get a bit hot and sweaty. Ooh. We have already walked the dog oh, this morning. We have, here she so, is. Um, yeah. Mila's obsessed, oh sorry about the mess, this is what we're going to be cleaning out, with chasing flies at the moment. She just goes in her bed, chills, and then you'll see her manically running around the house chasing flies. <gasps> see? What is it? And she's just spending her whole life doing that at the moment, so she's very entertained by the flies it's this time of year. I don't even know why I walk her. <laughs> she just does this all day, searching for flies. We're going to start off in the lounge, giving the lounge a deep, deep clean. Oh no, some of my leaves on my plant yes. are dying. I think also we awesome. need to organise a bit, because things are in random places, like a plant just randomly in front of it, in the middle of a window, mm. it's not ideal, is it? My canvases are everywhere as well, which it would look so much cleaner if I could find a different place for them. Yeah. Also, this is one of the ones I did oh, over the week. Oh, yes, gosh, you got that in nice and early. <laughs> yes, I did, boo. Prepped that one nice and early. Now, I'm just going to put it up here so I can decide where we're going to put all the rest of the canvases. But this is one that I showed... <laughs> James... <laughs> Can you not remember how to do it, Boo? Ah! Come on, there we go. You can play it while I clean. Yeah, I can't do that bit either. We need to play more of the piano. Maybe we should do some duet playing. You never want to play when it's sunny though, because you just... You just want to go outside. It's a winter hobby. Yeah, exactly. Maybe yeah. we'll play it more in the winter. So this was one of the canvases I did over the weekend, but basically there's just too many canvases now, so I need someone to put them. That would help a lot to tidy up, wouldn't it? Lots of, um, of units you can just put them in. I can hire a unit down, <laughs> down the road, hire one of those big storage big yellow boxes. Well, I don't want to put them in the garage because they'll go. get dusty. <laughs> Where am I meant to put them? I've already so got like... Put them in the attic. Here we go, I can or, just... if you do it neatly and get like a nice box, you can stack them and put them in the stairs for now. Yeah, that's you true. Need to, like just stack them nicely then. That's true. Okay, so lounge, lounge is our first project. Yes. Here we go. So, I think we need to get rid of one of Mila's beds. Yeah. yeah, I think it's time. We bought her this new bed and she does use it, she uses both of them, but I don't think there's a need to have two beds in here, I think that's a bit overkill. Would you keep the one, she's also got one in the kitchen. She's also got <laughs> one in the kitchen, yeah. So would you keep the one in the kitchen? Yeah, I just think we only need one bed in here. But then I think we should replace the one in the kitchen, because that's the smaller she one. She likes it though, she, does, she really yeah. likes them. I would just get rid of the old one. Yeah. I, we bought the new one to replace the yeah, old one. Yeah, it's gotta go. Yeah. She loves them both, so. We're gonna pop it in the garage, so if she does seem very upset, we can bring it back out. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh my god, that's so dirty, time yeah. to go. Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, Oh, she's so upset! Mills. So I have this, the corner which I showed over there somewhere, um, is where I do my arts and crafts in the evening and do my canvases. And I've got all this string, this is literally just new string that I ordered. Um, and I just, isn't that corner just an absolute mess, James? It is so bad, like honestly the string is just everywhere, so I'm going to spend loads of time now like sorting out all my string and all my arts and crafts and like James said, the TV cabinet, the one side of it is not used at all, so I'm going to have like a really organised arts and crafts string section, which I'm actually way too excited about for a 24 year old. So we 
taken out the rug, we've taken out the table, we've take, we've made a really good job so far. James has done an amazing job at just cleaning the windows, the fireplace, everything. Um, we're currently changing back the lampshade, yeah. if you guys remember. A little while ago we changed that lampshade because I thought it would go better with the room, but I didn't realise it was just way too white and it looks not as good as the old beigey lampshade which clearly matches the curtains better. So we're going to change that one back. If anyone spots anyone outside, it is Karis' granddad <laughs> and her dad who are doing social distancing gardening. Yeah, they literally well, are. Within five miles, it's all okay, guys. <laughs> yeah, in um, I think one of our last videos, you guys spotted my granddad. He loves to come and just prune my our garden because we know nothing about garden and he loves gardening. And it's literally the perfect social distancing thing for him because obviously he comes nowhere near us. Garden's huge and he just has a little go at all the plants and he loves it. It's very good for his mental health, which is lovely. So yeah, we're doing really well so far. Uh, we're nearly there, we're just bringing it all together. Woo! We are absolutely exhausted. Um, the room. What was that? It took about two hours. It did. It took quite a while, um, but we're finally there, and it looks very empty compared to before, mm -hmm. <laughs> but very organised. So we've literally just cleared everything off the fireplace, cleared everything off there. We've organised everything. We've cleaned everything. The floors, everything got hoovered. All the skirting behind the sofa, behind everything got hoovered. Everything was so disgusting behind the sofa. We pulled it out. There's like loads of bits of string, oh. dog hair. <laughs> it all just accumulates. You think behind the sofa, like what's going to get behind there? Like how could it travel all the way under to the back of the sofa? But stuff just gets under there. So it was so nice yeah. to just clean everything and just feel like it's all clean and this area is really clean now so I've got my little system now which is just I can have the canvas that I'm working on on the top canvas that I'm working on on the bottom that's all I'm allowed to keep over there and then I've got this drawer here which now has all of my stuff in it so I've got all my strings I've got blue light blue light green dark green browns red orange and yellows nudes pink light pink lighter pink white and off whites, blacks, and neutrals. Amazing! That's so organised, Cows. I'm so impressed. Thank you, Boo. I'm very excited about that little draw right there. Um, so yeah, we're feeling we're feeling good about the fact we've done the lounge. We're yeah. not going to be able to do much more, but we thought we might tackle the hall mm. as like a final yeah. oosh of the I day. I don't think it'll take that long through the hall, so fingers crossed. We're hoping not, but it's yeah. a little bit of a mess. But I feel like it's much more like just stuff that needs to be put away. Yeah, I agree. So here's our before. <laughs> And hopefully there'll be an after soon. After! Ta-da! We've done a cracking job today on the two rooms. Whew, we did the same. We moved everything into the middle. We deep cleaned. I know we didn't time lapse this one at all, but it wasn't you as exciting. Trust us, guys. You have to trust. We, we did. It, we promise. Although I don't understand. I feel like we've marked. Yeah, up that's annoying. Anybody? It might even be like. The kind of something peeling off. Yeah, it? exactly. Yeah. And so, Maybe but we use cleaning product. We shouldn't. Oopsies, we're not great at knowing what we're meant to use and what we're not, but I'm really happy with how that's turned out. We've got a lovely fresh hall running into a lovely clean lounge. Everything just looks so bare and empty. It looks great. <laughs> it looks really clean. I and like it, it smells fresh and yeah. just feels good. I love how you just hit the hood behind the door. I did, yeah. Just kind of like Sometimes you just gotta hide things away. When you... I quite fancy. Sorry, carry on. No, go on. I wasn't gonna say anything <laughs> exciting. Yeah. I quite fancy going on a bike ride. Ooh. Do you wanna come on, Boo? Do we have a bike for me? We could use your dad's potentially. Okay. Yes, we're gonna put a little bit of time aside now to do some something fitnessy. We like to try and do something fitnessy at least once a day where possible, which a lot of the time it is not possible. Um, but today we're gonna try and make some time for it. So. James is going to go on a little cycle ride and then he's going to come back and we're going to do a joint garden yeah. workout. 
I love, we haven't done a guard, garden workout in a while. No, I know. Um, we've been running a lot, as you guys saw in one of our last vlogs. We've been running um, on our dog walks and stuff like that. So we have been neglecting our garden workouts yeah, a little bit. So it'll be fun to get back into that. But I, I'm just not a cycler. I'm just not into I cycling. Because you you've got bigger legs. You're I know. You're built for cycling compared to running. True. Mm. But I just think I'm too scared to do it because I'm just going to get yeah. run over. Like, yeah. let's be real, I don't even know the rules of the road, let alone when I'm on a bike. So, I don't want to put anyone in that danger with me on the road on my bike. So, James is going to go and do that and then I shall meet you in the garden for a oh, workout. Ten minutes. We've got twenty minutes. Oosh! Okay, so we've got our stuff on. <laughs> we've literally... <laughs> Stop it. Stop it, you. Honestly, these are the best shorts ever. Um, I think they're sold out on Gymshark at the moment. This outfit is all Gymshark, by the way. Not sponsored. Well, it kind of is, but not really, because I'm working with them long term, but not necessarily on, on this exact wow. piece of content. You know, I just felt the need to clap. <laughs> as a Karis explanation, as always. No, honestly, these are the best shorts for working out, but I have a feeling they're out of stock. But when they come back in, honestly, I've never, I've got, as James said earlier, bigger thighs. So I do struggle to find shorts that are really good for working out, but these... What are the shorts called? Um, the Fit, Gymshark Fit, they're the Fit sort of like leggings range, and they fit. But they're called Fit? Shorts. Cycling shorts. Oh, are they? Yes. Oh, and you're making a point because I don't <laughs> like cycling. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so, it's, we think it's going to rain any second now, which is just typical. As soon as we want to go outside and do some exercise. Um, so, we think we're just going to skip. James is going to skip his cycle. We're going to go straight outside and do yeah. a workout. And James is going to plan the workout for yeah, us. Very quickly. You're just going to do a circuit, I think. Woo! A James circuit. They're Woo. always really hard. We're done working out now, it's starting to rain quite badly. Cass is over there, getting the washing in. Turning to a cracking, cracking homeowner. Honest to goodness, I don't know, I am dead. I only did two rounds of that last circuit. Cass did three, she absolutely flew through it. I feel so unfit, but so happy that we've trained. We haven't done that kind of training like Cass said at the start for weeks weeks yeah. and weeks all we've been doing is going on runs and stuff um so yeah muscular endurance is back that's horrible wasn't it Kaz? yeah it was awful but like we always try and stay positive even yeah. if you feel like absolute failure like you feel so unfit yeah. like it's always better than nothing and, and gotta, yeah to just it was always going to be beneficial and yeah you'll, you'll get better if you keep going yeah exactly the whole point is that you've exercised mm. it doesn't matter that you're struggling how kind of hard you find the exercise i think the whole point is is that kind of to improve you're meant to find the exercise hard yeah so you gotta look at you know struggling as a positive, positive not as a negative because you've worked well it's really starting to rain <sighs> yeah so i'm gonna i'm gonna have cars now okay so the workout was exhausting absolutely Honestly, we feel knackered yeah i did do that vlog. i did do a bit after oh yeah you that, did but i i don't ah! i don't know what yeah i just can't i'm not sure what's <laughs> happened to us but that was absolutely exhausting um so we've showered we're ready for the evening and we're actually popping out i'm gonna go to the range to <laughs> james is trying to get out of our road um i'm gonna go to the range and have a look at some artsy crafty bits and bobs mm -hmm. whilst james is where are you going food shopping no i'm gonna pop to pets at home to get me oh uh, yes food. Pets at home. So we're popping out now because I have started, well, I put on my story um, that I was maybe going to do some custom um, embroidery art pieces. Like it's shiny pieces. Yeah. It? It's very early days, but I've been talking on my Instagram story for a long time now about sort of selling my art because I've had so many people emailing and messaging about being able to get a piece oh, but it's so hard but it's so good it's so, it's so no no don't oh. do that to me don't do that to me i absolutely love it and i love the idea of doing <laughs> custom pieces and i've had so many emails today so i'm going to sit down when we get back and go through all of the emails mm -hmm. but i find it so much more exciting doing a custom commission of like because i've had so many emails of just absolutely random stuff that people want and i think it's nice if you're going to pay for like a sort of not luxury, but like a, you know, in, 
invest more into like an art piece it's nice to have it exactly how you like it yeah i'm very um, supportive of this venture yeah james is just like what no, you do with I your am. life but i love it it's a hobby yeah, like you do it in the evening anyway so why not start? i know and i'm sorry but i have about 50 canvases now it's just too many like i can't make any more for our house we need to start making them for other people <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i'm really excited like i love turning my hobbies into like mini businesses so email me if you'd like a commission or maybe just wait and see how it goes <laughs> first. So Ella and Christian cooked this very adult meal tonight. Whoop. Good job oh, guys. Nice. We have um, chicken and breadcrumbs with some chicken nuggets, <laughs> french fries and broccoli with they gravy. This cook. is actually amazing. They can. I said to cook <laughs> yeah, this. It was meant to be me. We are guys. <laughs> All right. We asked for this. We did. Well it was just kind of leftover food so it kind of yeah. kind of made sense I'm and um, we're gonna watch the Truman Show. Woo. I'm very excited about that. I haven't seen this in a long time. Yeah, Jim Carrey's your fave. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. a good show. Good. Until. Good morning guys, it is now, I just said good morning, it is not the morning it's at all. It's the next evening. It is the next evening we already. The next day, Carol's always likes to kind of start on like their new vlog. And she's I know. Like, Hey guys! Good morning! Whereas James is just like, hi, uh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I always like to do my yeah. dramatic start. Welcome back, it's know, the next day. <laughs> I don't know what happened, I don't know how we finished yesterday's vlog. Like, why didn't we carry on? What happened there? We just kind of ate dinner and then watched TV and fell asleep, I guess. That's literally how all our evenings go at the moment, yeah. so they're not very exciting. Proper lockdown evening. Yes, um, <laughs> but today we've been having a really productive day, we've been on the move. Look at my... Does everyone like my just... bright t-shirt? Look at us, look at Look at colours. us, it's our bright colours, know, Lou. look at us, we're shining. I said to James a couple of days ago, actually, I was like, I'm going to start wearing, didn't I say this? Bright colours, like I'm such a neutral person, I love my neutral nudes and like Guys. blacks and everything like that. I'm gonna start wearing bright, like blues, yeah, yeah. yellows. Oh my gosh. What are you? Guys, she did say this. She's oh, lying. right. He's she did. This. I'm backing you up. I'm backing you up, girl. You said this. <laughs> I did. And I was like, I just wanna wear really bright, happy colors. And this is just. And she's doing it. This is actually a sample for some future merch, mm -hmm. potentially. But I just fell in love with the color, so I just wanted to wear it because it makes me smile. Just, you know, You're just zoning out, bright, boo. Bright kind of person. You're always wearing bright colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so anyway, we've been really productive today. I thought I'd just show you what I've been getting up to. Um, we didn't have a McDonald's, that's definitely not why there's a McDonald's cup right there. Um, I've been doing one of the commission pieces for um, someone that emailed me. I have had Don't just lie, a we emailed you. And she went, I saw this really cute sausage dog the other day. There she is. Mila, is this your girlfriend? Don't you dare touch my canvas, okay? I'm trying to be professional and keep them very clean. Yep, I've been canvassing whilst watching Gossip Girl, James exposing me. But yeah, I did, I put on my story about some commissions and I've been discussing some with some people and this is how, how far I've got with this one. Obviously it's gonna look very different, but this is her pooper, Nelly. Oh, it's so cute. So hopefully I'm gonna bring Nelly to life on a canvas. I'm so excited. I would have honestly never thought about doing a pet or a dog until everybody wants their pets on dogs on canvases. Honest to goodness, the, what we spend money on for our animals is just ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah. It's like, you know, can't afford any purse myself, but I'm gonna spend 80 quid on a new dog bed. Oh yeah. That's like such an owner thing to do. It <laughs> so is. Like, why did me? Why did we get Mila three beds? Well, why wouldn't we get Mila what, three beds? What, why wouldn't we get Mila yeah. anything she wanted ever? Hello, baby girl. Why have we put this rug in the lounge from the kitchen? Oh yes, for Mila, because oh. she wants a fluffy rug, rug in here. Yeah, so. Yeah. Because we obviously in this vlog tidied this room and we put that there as like a temporary rug Like I said in a um, a previous vlog, we're actually going to do a massive transformation of this room We're hopefully going to get like a jute rug Which is just going to be a bit easier because the fluffy ones get so dirty, don't they? They just get stuff all stuck in them So anyway, we put that down there and then last night Mila was just like sitting on the wooden floor And I know she loves fluffy rugs We let her go out for a wee, this is a really boring story I'm not even sure why I'm telling you this, oh my goodness Go on, tell me more details Okay, okay, just wait for the ending and she went for we would let her out here to go this is seriously why am i still telling it Just she went to get, <laughs> she went out the back to go to the toilet and then she came back in and she usually comes straight back in here and sits down and waits for her treat when we're going yeah. up to bed yeah. and she went straight into the kitchen onto the fluffy rug so i was like james she wants a fluffy yeah. rug in her bedroom so then i made james bring in i know we nearly we're nearly at the end of the story bring in this fluffy rug from the kitchen for mila to have and look she's sitting on it you love the fluffy rug. You love the fluffy rug. Are you a spoiled girl? Are you a spoiled girl? Yeah. She's so cute. Nope. <laughs>
Dad, stop it. Okay. Okay, that's enough Mila and enough from us before I tell any more really stupid <laughs> stories. Um, anyway, so I think that is it from us oh, yes, for this vlog. We will see you guys in the next video. We hope you enjoyed. We're not really sure what this vlog no. was, but we, we had fun. We cleaned a room or two. We cleaned. Was, We've got a really exciting yeah. transformation coming in, I think it's the next video. Mm -hmm. You guys suggested it as well, so get ready for it. Guess what it is. Hello. Yeah, you guys did suggest it. You gave me the idea. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed. We'll see you in the next video. Please give the video a like if you did enjoy. It. Leave us a comment below. Subscribe if you're new and turn your notice on. See you in the next Love video. Love you guys. Bye. <laughs>